McCoy Tanner Trio, Stanley Clark on bass, Peter Erskine on drums, Miles Davis, So What? I think you'll like this. I have uh, been a Stanley Clark fan since he arrived with Chick and Return to Forever. Actually, before that, I had seen Ch I had seen uh, Stanley Clark play with Pharaoh Sanders. Uh, there was a radio station, a jazz radio station in New York in the 70s, WRVR, uh, owned by a church, and it got purchased by, uh, I forget the name of the group, a bunch of radio stations. They eventually took jazz off uh, New York radio and put a country western station on there. Uh, that was a shock. When you went, one morning you went to your radio to hear WRVR, and the great jazz they played on there. People like Ed Beach, Ed Beach just jazz was the host. And then you're in country music. Uh, that's the world of business, that's the world of radio. But uh, there was a benefit for WRVR at the Beacon Theater. And Pharaoh Sanders played, and he had this young bassist, Stanley Clark. Uh, who shortly after that the recording was released, Black Unity, uh, when Pharaoh was doing a lot of things for Impulse. Staley was on that, and I was struck by his young mastery of the instrument, his sound, and then he started to play with Chick. Uh, I saw the initial uh, incarnation of Return to Forever, which was Joe Farrell, Chick Corea, Stanley Clark, and Ierto on drums, and Flora on vocals. And then the, uh, Joe Farrell left. Joe Farrell and Chick did a lot of great work together. I'm a big fan of Joe Farrell's tenor playing. Uh, but they turned into a trio, just Chick and Stanley and Ayerto. And people know Ayerto, Ayerto is a percussionist, but he's a great trap drummer as well. And then uh, Chick and uh, Stanley did the third incarnation of Return to Forever, which was its most popular, uh, the band with uh, El Demiola and uh, Lenny White. And they did some great music for that for a long time. And Stanley Clark has gone on to play with many, many people. He's done soundtracks. He is a superb bassist, an instantly recognizable approach. And uh, it's really good to hear him and Peter Erskine uh, work out with uh, McCoy Tyner here on So What?
Thank you.